good morning guys it's just about morning almost afternoon today i'm working from home ignore the state of me oh my god i've just spent the whole morning catching up on work emails and yeah i'm gonna try and film some content during my lunch because i definitely need to do that because i know i'm gonna be too busy during the week it's so nice with the christmas tree in the background it looks amazing in daylight this is what it looks like in daylight. I did put a star on there and it actually lights up. So, light. And this is what it looks like when it's lit up. Because the lights are so white, it kind of looks bluish. But I, I'm not mad at it. We also got this little thing from Tesco. It was on offer. I don't know what to put in there. We need to get a plant for it, but it's so nice. Once we have all our living room stuff, it's going to look pretty cute. Yeah, I need to sort myself out. I need to do my hair. So yeah, I'll see you guys in a bit. Guys, it's now the end of the day, literally. It's a bit echoey in here. It really is. It's weird talking in here. Brushing my hair. Literally just ignore it because like this is like done nothing with it. Like I don't even know what I'm gonna do with it tomorrow. Maybe a quick blow dry. I literally spent like an hour after work just scrolling through the internet, going through things I want to buy for Black Friday because there's like actually a lot of good offers especially if you're looking into like home stuff like it's very tempting now, i'm gonna make some food now so i'm going to attempt to make something called let me search this up before like i butcher it bibim bibimbap it has rice like a bunch of veggies you can add a meat of your choice and like an egg on top with like some sauce kind of looks like this i took i was watching someone's vlog jen im and she does these like what I eat in a week videos and literally they're so satisfying. But anyways, we've had bibimbap before, but when I saw her make it, like I literally wanted to try and make it. And if I can make it, oh my God. Has anyone else seen clips of Adele's concert? Cause I'm seeing it everyone on TikTok and like, I literally want to watch it. It just seems so angelic and beautiful. I wish I was there. <laughs> this is the finished result i'm actually quite proud of it the only thing i would say is that there's a lot that there's a bunch of steps to it like it's easy but there's a lot of steps like cutting all the stuff cooking each bit i'm gonna do a little taste test take a little bit of everything This is quite nice. I'm actually really proud of this. This is it, man. I'm gonna go enjoy my food, but I'll leave a link to the recipe in the info box so you guys can try it out. Just about to head out, guys. Um, we're gonna go have some lunch in, well, late lunch, I would say, in London. But before I head out, I just wanted to give a shout out to iHerb for sponsoring today's video. I have a little haul that I'm gonna do today to show you guys what I picked up from their website, which was, by the way, so easy to navigate through. If you didn't know, iHerb actually offers over 3,000 products in a variety of categories, including supplements, sport nutrition, beauty, bath, baby, pets and groceries that's a lot of things i literally had to think of that like i had to like kind of memorize all the stuff because they have so much stuff on the website so yeah i'm just gonna dive in straight into my wall the first thing that i picked up is this real technique setting brush now i thought they discontinued this brush honestly like i literally love this so much i've only got one and i bought it years ago and i can't find it anywhere like i feel like you can only get it if you buy it in a set but yeah, I was so happy to see this on their website because literally it's like my go-to brush for setting powder and uh, applying my concealer. Um, so yeah, I'm just so happy I got this. It's basically, I don't know if you can see, it's like the perfect shape for like powder and concealer for like under the eyes. It, it just fits in perfectly. And also iHerb has its own line of exclusive brands that you can get from their website and they're all produced in-house. So I picked up some vitamin D3, um, kind of like tablets 
yeah these are tablets and i also got the gummies because i do like gummy vitamins um i'm not going to take these at the same time but i just wanted to you know over time try them both i think the amount of uh, vitamin d3 in here um kind of appealed to me it was much higher than the, the gummies so i'm definitely gonna try these first and then the next one is just vitamin again vitamin d3 it's mixed berry and fruit gummies um so this one has uh 50 mcg per serving and this one has 125 so the tablet certainly has more and um, they're both by california gold nutrition which is an iher brand so yeah i need these like i'm telling you my gp is always like my doctor's always saying like you need to get vitamin d because every time i do a blood test i'm always low in it and they just tell you to like buy your own so i always never buy it so literally this is definitely going to come in handy i also i've also heard like you just feel like less lethargic and just tired all the time when you do take your vitamin d tablets um you sleep better apparently i mean these are just claims but you know we'll see how it goes i'll keep you guys updated i'm an absolute sucker for the neutrogena hydro boost range so i picked up the gel cream extra dry moisturizer kind of thing it says it instantly quenches extra dry skin which is what i have especially around my nose it, and it keeps the skin looking smooth supple and hydrated day after day so yeah really excited to try this next up i picked up two moisturizers by this brand that i've never heard before i love trying new skincare and this brand's called andalou naturals so i got the probiotic c plus c renewal cream i think it's like a day cream it says brightening which kind of like appeal to me it says it it gives a luminous complexion a brighter looking appearance targeting overexposed surface cells so like i think it targets like hyperpigmentation and it just says apply daily and then i got the resveratrol q10 night repair cream this says it's age defying so yeah i'll if this really stands out to me you'll definitely hear more about them in my future videos i also picked up some almond oil i feel like i need to put this in my hair um it says it's for skin but it's 100 percent pure almond oil and i used to put this in my hair and it, it really helped so yeah i'm really excited about this and then the next thing is so random but i really needed it for my cats especially chi chi who has really long fur i got this self-cleaning slicker so it detangles gives care to their undercoat and it's like a special brush for like cats it just clings on really nicely so yeah like i just really love that there's a variety of products on there like this is so random but you know they have everything on their website so yeah that's the last bit of my haul you can check out my description box for all the links to the products that i've just mentioned in today's video and you can get an additional discount with my rewards code anushka which i will also leave in the description box for you guys to use another thing that really stood out to me uh with the iherb website is that they have a cool rewards program where you can earn credit in three ways the first way you can earn credit is by reviewing the products you purchased uh, secondly you can answer any questions that are asked by other customers on products that you've purchased previously and then thirdly whenever you refer to friends and family you'll also get credit that way too once you uh, get to a certain amount you can claim your your money so yeah it's just such a cool feature so yeah that's it from me guys don't forget to check out the links and my rewards code in the description box and let's head out <laughs> Um, they already put the Christmas lights out. You guys will see it better later on when it's darker, innit? It? It's a bit... can't really see them. Oh, nice. look at this. How cute is this? We're going to this one here, which is... What is it called? Yakocho. No, Yokocho. What is this lighting? What is this lighting? I don't know, but it's nice. Do you like it? Yeah. We got some chicken yakitori, like skewer sticks. Oh, I'm sure. 
Yeah, Krishna needs a concealer. I still got my shade matching skills and I don't even work for them. Wait, I don't I was taffy. Yeah, that one's perfect. It's white light, so I think like it's true. Yeah. True to colour. Yeah. Guys, I've been wanting to come to this cake shop bakery in so long. So we're gonna go in and check out the desserts. So I might get one thing. Are you gonna get us? White chocolate, Might birthday cake. Might get birthday cake. Can we get one red velvet cake? Stop it. <laughs> she always does this to me. <laughs> I knew you. We literally fight each other every time. Oh, we are selling cupcakes. Oh, nice, isn't it? You can tell it's chewy as well. Wait, let's try my one. I'm scared sometimes. It's about leaving my camera laying around. Yeah, you're just like, what's my camera? It's an awkward um, angle. cornflake brownies that I always make because she makes these cornflake brownies hmm. it's like a youtuber like I follow her baking videos yeah it's cupcake Gemma oh, okay. and I think this is like kind of her bakery I think so I'm not completely sure <laughs> and they make cornflake brownies and it's the best thing ever but they changed their like try it I've made it from her videos oh okay that makes sense I want this mango okay. This one's nice, right? Yeah. Four pounds seventy-nine for one mango. Excuse me. I'm going south for. <laughs> yeah, that looks sweet. They're soft. This is three fifty. Which one's better though? I feel like this one's gonna be better. This one. Yeah. Should I get it? Yeah, try it. Oh, they have the yellow dragon fruit. Where? There. Get it for me. Get it for me. What, this one? Yeah. What, that one? The yellow one. Get me the big one behind it. <laughs> Do you know what this is? No, I've never had it. Do you like fruit? No, this is not dragon. It's, yeah, that's It's dragon. a melon. I thought it was a yellow dragon fruit. Nah. Three pounds for this, people. Three pounds. <laughs> We're in Whole Foods right now. Oh, their pizza slices oh, are nice. That's really nice. Yeah, we, always, we all, always used to get their pizza slices been obsessed with this drink and also glass straws I used to use metal ones but glass straws are so much better i got a few packages one from kayali my favorite perfume brand i've obviously mentioned this before but these are so exciting because they have a collection of like eight trial size juices in a unique travel friendly set and you literally have all of them like that makes such a nice gift i'll show you guys i don't know if you guys remember how i told you that i don't carry the perfumes on me 
but this is definitely like one of these are gonna go in my handbags what is wrong my hair i love this my favorite are vanilla i think vanilla cocoa which was utopia no i think my top two are elixir and vanilla and i always wear those two like every day and then i love uh, utopia vanilla cocoa which is great for every day and sweet diamond was one of my fave but it's definitely more for like going out i would say and invite only is really beautiful it's it gives me like a middle eastern kind of scent that it's a scent that i would imagine to smell in in dubai or something and that's something that uh, mona mentioned uh, during the event and it's a scent that i also smell a lot when we were in india it's very oud oudy so yeah i love these travel sizes and also we got a vanilla hand cream and vanilla is my favorite scent so i'm gonna love this so thank you so much kayali oh my god i look like a wreck i just got home from work and my journey was actually not bad have you guys seen these fruits before like a permission or something like that it says you can eat like an apple but if it gets mushy you can eat it with a spoon and i feel like i want to wait till it i can eat it with a spoon so i'm gonna have a clementine this was my work outfit today very comfy Both the trousers and the top are from Naked. So comfy and this top is from New Look. I'm back at my desk again. To be honest, today is an extremely boring day. I've got training. That will be most of my day, but I wanted to share this fruit with you guys because um, I mentioned it last night and I didn't think it was ready, but I took a bite of one. I literally couldn't wait. And it's so nice. Like I can't explain the taste. I'm eating it like an apple and it's very sweet. I don't know i can't explain it it's just really sweet and nice like like i would definitely buy it again but you just need to give it time to soften and ripen so yeah i always look estate don't i <laughs> but yeah there's nothing special going on on my side it's like a mix between a mango and a date the taste i don't know how to explain it so yeah i'll see you guys later